friends today video is very important how to prepare different ppm solution from standard now you can see this is the iron standards 1000 ppm i will make different uh, solution from this crm 0.5 1 and 2 ppm solution now move to the calculation part guys okay friend this is our question how to make 0.5 1 ppm 2 ppm solution from 1000 ppm solution in 100 ml so we will prepare all these standard solution in 100 ml so it is very important to note to know the concentration in which we will prepare the standard solution okay now we will move to the calculation part firstly our aim to prepare 10 ppm stock solution okay friends now it is this formula as well you aware n1 v1 equal to n2 v2 v1 our calculation part and n2 is 10 ppm into 100 is our makeup volume divided by 1000 ppm so we will get value 1 ml so we need 1 ml in 100 ml solution for preparing 10 ppm solution okay friends now we will move to the practical part okay now we will take 1 ml in 100 ml volumetric flask so we will take 1 ml iron standard solution from our standard 1000 ppm now we will dissolve thoroughly it is not very important part when you prepare any standards mixing in proper manner it is very important so mix in clockwise direction and anti-clockwise direction and take at least 30 seconds for mixing and also note second point all glassware should be clean clean with chromic acids and after that use distilled water for deionized okay now time for make up our standard solution so we will take lower meniscus okay friends now our standard is ready it is our stock solution 10 ppm solution okay friends from this stock solution we will make a, another three solution 0.5 1 and 2 ppm please guys note it 1 ppm equal to 1 ml please don't be confused from this so now we move to the calculation part okay first aim to prepare 0.5 ppm solution so same formula n1 v1 equal to n2 v2 so we will find the v1 value so we need 5 ml for ppm 0.5 ppm solution for 1 ppm we need 10 ml so 1 it is our target area into 100 makeup volume and 10 is our stock solution so we will get 10 ml for similarly we will for 2 ppm we need 20 ml okay friends we use same formula n1 v1 equal to n2 v2 and we will get these values for 0.5 we need 5 ml for 1 ppm we need 10 ml for 2 ppm solution we need 20 ml now move to the practical session pipettes it is very easy to handle and give accurate and PC size result so we adjust at 5 ml it is our target as well you know 